Welcome back to the BK42 channel. Today we'll take a look at the Lankel SEXC 4000 electric fat bike. A bike designed to handle the most difficult mountain trails and snow rides, but also an excellent option for commuting and grocery shopping. Let's get right to it and start with the Shimano Turny 7 Speed Derailleur, which provides smooth and precise shifting, making it easier to ride on diverse terrains. The monochrome LCD display, which displays all vital information such as speed, distance, and battery life, is another excellent feature of this bike. It's straightforward to read and use, even when cycling over challenging terrain. The hydraulic zoom brakes of the Lankel SEXC 4000 have 180mm rotors. These brakes are definitely robust, but they aren't as powerful as Shimano's top-of-the-line brakes. However, they do the job, especially considering the price of the bike. When it comes to braking, the left lever controls the rear brake while the right lever controls the front brake. This is important to remember whether you're riding on the trails or cruising around town. The 48 volts, 17.5 ampere hour battery is easily removable from the bike. This bad boy can take you on a sweet ride of about 40 to 50 kilometers on a single charge. And if you put in some leg power, you could even extend that range to a whopping 100 kilometers. When it's time to charge up, the battery usually needs around 6 hours to reach full juice and you can either charge it up while it's still connected to the bike, or pop it out and take it somewhere else to charge it. As for removing the battery, it's pretty straightforward. Just use the key they give you to unlock it, pull the lever, and take it out. Oh, and one last cool thing about this battery, it comes with a handy status indicator and a USB port that could be a lifesaver if your phone's battery is running low. The powerful 1000 watts hub, along with the massive 26 inches wheel, makes this bike an excellent choice for any off-road trip, and, with the all-terrain 26x4 tires, you can feel confident riding in any condition. The bike's top speed should be 45 km per hour, according to the Lankalesi website, but I've yet to exceed 42 km per hour. Nonetheless, the motor is certainly powerful, with a torque of 95 Nm. With this bike, you can effortlessly travel long distances at a rapid pace. Check out the awesome sound of these huge tires cruising down the road and the silent hub motor revving up. The pedal assistant works like a charm. It kicks in super quickly when I need that extra boost, and the moment I stop pedaling, it cuts the power without any delay whatsoever. And if I even touch the brake levers, the power is automatically cut off. Overall, I'm really impressed with this pedal assist system. The aluminum frame of this bike is well crafted, with a one-size design, and the welding is flawless. Furthermore, the painting is of high quality, and I especially appreciate the color scheme. Furthermore, the included plastic fenders are excellent, and their color coordination with the rest of the bike's design enhances its visual appeal. The XC4000's front suspension is a true beast off-road, offering stability and a smooth ride thanks to its stiffness and rebound settings. But don't be fooled by its off-road prowess, this suspension also performs in the city. This bike has 73cm handlebars and a high-quality stem to complete the front end. The standard hand grips get the job done, and you can use the half-throttle to ride without pedaling. It has a chain wheel with 46 teeth, which gives benefits such as faster speeds, faster power transfer, and greater chain retention. If your power runs out, you can still ride your bike home thanks to the huge chain wheel and 7-speed gear. I like how the cable management on this bike is tidy and well-organized. Lankalesi has successfully ensured that the cables are neatly placed and clutter-free. The bike's headlight is super bright, and you can control it using the switch on the handlebar. And, guess what? The headlight also has a loud horn built in, which is really practical. But, if you're not into horns, don't worry, the manufacturer also included a little bell. The bike doesn't have a built-in taillight, but it does come with a reflector. It would be awesome to have back and brake lights too. Before we dive into the pros and cons of this bike, I'd like to note out that the controller is well-placed, it's small and blends right in, and the rear rack is super handy, making this mountain bike a versatile option for getting around town and running errands. Let's see the pros and cons. Let's begin with the pros. Powerful motor with 95 newton meters of torque. Removable 48 volts, 17.5 ampere hour battery with status indicator and USB port. Hydraulic zoom brakes with 180 mm rotors. Smooth and precise gear shifting. Tidy and well-organized cable management. 3-year warranty. Now let's see the cons. The rear brake could use some improvement. 
Top speed may not reach the advertised 45 km per hour. There is no taillight. A reflector is present, but no integrated light. There is no cruise control or app integration. This is not a lightweight bicycle at 32 kilos. The Lankel SEXC 4000 electric fat bike arrived in great condition, it was well packed and protected during shipping. Fortunately, there were no damages, and assembly was a breeze. If you need any help putting it together, check out our step-by-step -step assembly video. To complete this video, if you're in the market for a high-performance mountain bike, this one is definitely worth considering. It not only looks amazing, but it also rides like a dream. It's safe, comfortable, and you're getting a lot of bang for your buck with this one. The Lankel SEX C4000 electric fat bike costs €1,499 right now, and they ship it for free in Europe and the United States. But what really gets me hyped is the three-year warranty that comes with it. That just makes me feel even more stoked about this bike. If you want to check it out or buy one for yourself, make sure to use the link provided in the description below. As we wrap up this video, make sure to double check your local e-bike regulations and laws to make sure this bike is allowed in your city. And don't forget to wear proper riding gear to protect yourself. That's it for today's review. Let me know in the comments if you like this bike, if you already own one, and if you have any questions, I'll try my best to respond as soon as possible. Cheers!